is my videogram to you. I've wanted you for the longest. I fought for you. I've longed and dreamed all summer nights into the long winter nights. Just dreaming of the day that I can get my hands on you. That I can feel you and rub you through my fingers and smell you and just allow your colors to wash over me. I sent you many messages in bottle, hoping that there will be that one day where you will be able to return, for our love for you will never sway. And even though there may be others that come around and try to entice me, I might nibble a little bit here and there, but I promise it will never fully have my heart like you do. There's things about you that I would change, but you're still complete. Something about you that just tickles my inner core. For that I will be forever indebted. And if you show up one day, Even know what I will do with myself. <laughs> Maybe just laugh all day and just skip around the world because I know that the minute I see you, it's impossible for anything to ever go wrong. I love you, HB. Hurry home. <gasps> HB! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! She's here! I love you. I love you. HB has returned to me. Let's go make out. What's up? Welcome to This Is Daisy. This video is going to be a makeup tutorial slash mini review. First, let's dive into this look and see how you get this look using the beautiful palette. I will leave the review of the palette towards the end. Don't forget to like my video and... on this palette 
first and foremost, I do not like the packaging. I think it's super cheap. This palette is $65. I grabbed mine at Sephora. I don't think it justifies giving $65 for something like this. For me, if I'm gonna give that amount of money for a palette, I want the whole experience to be high quality. Putting that aside, once you open the palette, there's no mirror. I mean, it's not a deal breaker for me. So what you have here is a row of mattes here on the bottom. And then the middle row here is matte. And then you have two shimmers on the side. And these are the foiled eyeshadows on the top. As I was using it on this tutorial, the colors are highly pigmented. They're beautiful. They're bold, rich. And the fallout was very minimal. The foils are a little bit more difficult to work with because the best application on using these folds is by using your fingertips so that you can get the maximum amount of pigment onto your eyelids. And sometimes that's a little bit... If you're working with precise work on your eyes, it's a little bit more difficult. Other than that, once you do swipe your fingers in, it is malleable, it's creamy. I found that trying to apply it with the brush, it didn't give me the saturation that I was looking for. Obsessed with like the cranberry colors. I even love this pink. It's like a cooler type of pink. I am so impressed with the quality of these eyeshadows. They're beautiful, consistent. I find that in most palettes that I have purchased, you either got a few eyeshadows that are rich and velvety and creamy and then there's a few duds in there. Follow me on social media. Everything is on the description box below and I will catch you on my next ride.